Hey guys, welcome back to Vanguard Motor Sales. Look at this, 70 Chevelle, big block, four speed, black interior. You're gonna love checking this one out. Now we're gonna put it up on the lift so you can check out the underside. We're gonna pop the hood and fire it up. We're gonna go out and drive it. We're gonna look inside the trunk. We're gonna show you everything you wanna see so you can make a great decision on your Chevelle investment. So come on up right now and we'll get this hood up and fire it up. So check this beauty out, man. Those stripes are underneath the clear. I can just barely feel them. We got great looking chrome on the bumper. Headlight surrounds look good. The grill surround looks good. The SS emblem looks great. Got hood pins to keep the hood down with all that horsepower under that hood. Got great looking wheel and tire combo on it. It's actually got the polyglass tires just like came from the factory. Wheel lip moldings look good. SS emblem with the 396 here looks good. All the stainless steel's in good shape. Door handle looks like it's brand new. All the moldings here all look brand new. That uh, window molding also looks new. That door operates nice and smooth and look at that. Looks brand spanking new in there. Latch looks like it's been taken out and cleaned up. Got new rubber, door panel looks good, armrest looks good, chrome on the handles looks good, steering wheel looks great. There's that four speed shifter hooked up to that four speed. Um, we got great looking upholstery here. All the chrome here looks good. We got seat belts in the rear. Looks like there's three seat belts back there and upholstery in the back seats looking great. Headliner looks great. It's got shoulder belts, dome lights working. Dash pad itself looks good. The dash itself is looking great. All the chrome around the gauges, the lenses on the gauges, the faces on the gauges all look great. It's got a sun tack in there. You look down that long quarter panel, body works straight as an arrow. Chrome on the back bumper looks brand new. The exhaust tips look brand new. That Chevelle emblem looks brand new. And again, those stripes are buried in the clear. I can just barely feel them, but it is nice and smooth. Inside the trunk, look at that. Spare tire, jack, nice coating there. Back sides of the quarters look good. The uh, wheel wells are nice and solid. Bottom side of the deck lid's nicely painted. You can see they took the time to take the latch out when they did the paint work. The lips here, nice and smooth, nicely finished. All the gutters here look nice and clean and painted. The rubber looks good. Look down the side of the car. Look how nice and straight that is. Can you imagine the amount of hours the painter had in this thing, blocking and sanding it to get this beautiful of a paint job on this car? I forgot to mention, it's even got a center console with a couple drink holders in there, just like your new cars. Hey, at Vanguard Motor Sales, we are not consignment dealers. That means we own this car. Right now, we've got a little over 230 cars in stock, and we bought 48 cars last month. What that means to you is we've always got new inventory coming in, and we've got plenty to choose from. Now, I'm involved in buying every one of the cars here at Vanguard, so I'm helping you pick out your dream car. Chevelle time guys, four speed. Listen to that exhaust, man. This thing, people know you're coming in this baby. This thing sounds great, I love it. Now at Vanguard Motor Sales, we can ship this Chevelle anywhere in the world. You just call Tom at 248-974-9513. He'll tell you just how easy it is to park this dream in your drive. Now it does have power steering, it's driving great. And I tell you, the shifter's working awesome. It is a four speed, sounding fantastic. Like I said, I love loud pipes. Listen to this, just touching the throttle. Sounds great. Now we can ship it anywhere in the world. Just call Tom. 
We can also help you with financing on this car. We can get this dream parked in your driveway with about a 15 minute phone call to the banker. We'd love to get this dream parked in your drive. We're right outside the Motor City. We're real close to fine from the airport. Only 20 minutes from the airport. We sell most of our cars sight unseen, but we do love to have visitors, so please come on out and check out the car in person. We're, like I said earlier, we're real close to the airport. We're open on Saturdays, so we'd love to have you come out and check it out in person. Send an inspector. We'll treat an inspector just like we treat you. No problem whatsoever. And we also have a whole team of mechanics. So if you'd like to do something extra to the car, or you'd like to change something or add something, just call Tom, we can handle it. We got a whole team of mechanics. We can do anything to a muscle car that needs to be done. I can't get over the exhaust in the car. It just sounds great. You can see down here on the dash that the, uh, the speedo's working, the gas gauge is working, the tack is working. Everything's all set here, guys. Then we got a two pack of gauges down here underneath the dash. Then of course that Hurst shifter is working great. Now here's our building. We're at 15100 Keel Street, Plymouth, Michigan. And we're about to do something that nobody else in the industry does. We're gonna put this car on the lift so you can check out the underside. Then we're gonna pop the hood and see what's making all that music coming out of those tailpipes. All right, we're underneath this 70 Chevelle now. And man, she's pretty under here. Look at that trunk floor. It looks brand new. The tank looks new. And it's got some little short glass packs on it. That's what's giving it the unique sound. You can see urethane bushings here and the body mounts. The drop downs look good. The pinch weld where the floor goes to the inner wheelhouse looks good. We got right around a 323 gear in here and it is posy. Looks like new shocks, got urethane bushings uh, here on the lower control arms. Those are reinforced. It does have the extra braces that the SS has had. We got urethane bushings on the upper control arms too. And then we've got this resonator pipe here. Again, that's what's giving it that unique sound. Um, I always check the low areas in the frame here on these cars. This is a real good area to take a look at that, you know, try to judge the, uh, what the car, the shape of the car. This frame looks great. Now the fuel line looks good. The brake line looks new. Parking brake cable looks new. Pinch weld looks good. Bottom side of the rocker also looks good. All things you need to be looking at when you're buying one of these cars. Cross member, somebody had it out. Looks like it's been powder coated. We got a Muncie Trans here. We got the stock appearing bell housing, the stock appearing clutch linkage. Looks like all the brake lines here, including the uh, distribution block here, is all brand new. Cross member up front also looks good. You can see it didn't run into any railroad tracks or anything like that. It's nice and straight. And these will also rot out on you. So you want to make sure you take a look at this on every car you look at. I do see new ball joints top and bottom. I see disc brakes here. Looks like new rotors. Now in the back we do have drums and the guys will pull those all apart. Make sure they're in good working order. Also look at the front frame horns. These two front frame horns look nice and straight. No evidence that the car has ever been in an accident. Uh, front bumper looks new. Also, look at the core support. The core support's one of the first things to go on these cars too. This core support looks like it's brand spanking new. Now let's look at those wheels and tires. All right, up front here, we've got the painted SS wheels with good looking trim rings and center caps. And we do have the polyglass tires. And these are 7014s. I always take a look at the bottom of the front fenders too. Uh, take a look at where they bolt to the rocker here and take a look at the bottom side of the fender itself. All I feel is nice smooth metal in there. And look at that rocker and that pinch weld. It is beautiful. Let's look at the rear. All right, out back here again, polyglass tires. Same good looking rims, same good looking trim rings. Always feel this edge too. All I feel there is where the inner wheelhouse goes out to the quarter and you can tell the wheel lip molding looks like it's new. And again, look at that rocker. She is beautiful. Now that hole right there is actually a drain hole. It's supposed to be there. That's also some place you can peek up in there and see just how solid it is. Let's get under the hood. 
All right, under the hood here, we've got a uh, 396. It was cast in 1969. It does have a winner's intake on it. That's an original GM intake. It's got a 780 Holley on it. That is a four barrel, guys. You can see the jet coated headers. We got a fakey top on the battery here, make it look like one of the old fashioned batteries, which is very cool. Chrome valve covers look new. We got the seal to seal down to that cowl induction hood. Firewall's nicely painted. Alternator looks like it's freshly rebuilt. It does have power steering. We do have power brakes, and the whole brake system looks like it's new. The master and the power booster both look new. Um, all the high pressure lines going to the uh, power steering look new. Inner wheelhouses look good. Upper uh, control arms have urethane bushings. They look new. Um, everything about this car looks new, guys. The top side of the core support looks good. Radiator looks like it's a freshly rebuilt unit. Everything about this car is awesome, guys. She's a 70 Chevelle, probably the most popular on the planet. She's a 396 and a four speed. It's red, it's got black interior. She's gorgeous. Call us at 248 974 9513 in my Vanguard Motor Sales Park this stream and your driveway.